Hey brother, welcome back. Charlie here from Happy Man Coaching. In this video, I want to talk to you about your sexual value. I'm out here walking the dog, talking to you about your sexual value because this comes up a lot in the community. It comes up as a topic because we are generally in a long-term committed relationship with someone, with a woman, and we may even be married and when we want to have sex and she says no, we may feel like she holds the keys to our happiness, that she gets to determine our sexual value. And a lot of times we place a lot of value on her. We place a lot of value on getting sex from her. But we don't recognize that we have sexual values, that we can actually decide to give pleasure to someone, to give ourselves to someone or not. And so we have to learn to become owners of our sexual value, that we have to see ourselves as a high value sexual individual, that we have to see ourselves as good looking and handsome and creative and energetic and all of the things that are attractive that attract another person to us, something that makes us feel good about ourselves. And if we don't do that, if we allow someone else to be in charge of that, then we're handing over our power. We're actually letting them define our worth and value. And so it doesn't mean that they have to say yes. It doesn't mean that they owe us anything. It doesn't mean that they have to compromise themselves. It just means that we have to, at some point, recognize that, that we have value as a man in our relationship. And so <clears throat> one of the things that we want to do is we want to get a haircut. We want to look at our clothes. We want to decide for ourselves how we feel about ourselves. And if we don't feel good about ourselves, if we don't feel confident, if we don't feel high value, then that's something that we need to work on. That's something that we need to address for ourselves because Imagine this, how could you expect anyone to value you more than you value yourself? If you're asking that other person to want you, to desire you, to value you, and you don't value yourself, you don't see yourself as high value, you don't see yourself as worthy of love and intimacy and connection, then how can you ask someone else to do that? So. This is something that I work with men on, I talk with men all the time on. It's something that requires conversation. It's something that requires time in order to, for these concepts to sink in and for the clarity to come that we need in order to start valuing ourselves. And that's a conversation that I would like to have with you. So what I want you to do is I want you to email me, charles at happymancoaching.com, and let's talk about that. Let's talk more about your sexual value and what it is that you are doing or not doing and how you're seeing yourself and what you're asking someone else to do that you're not doing for yourself. All right? Talk to you later, brother. Love you.